Whenever I pop into Mormon Mother's class, I see a person who is basically a parent with my children. So I know when I send my children into Mormon Mother's class, it's almost like another parent with as much love as Rose and I have for our children is that parent in the class as well as a phenomenal teacher. She makes every child feel important. She knows what every child needs and she makes them reach their full potential. What I think happens with Maura Millie and the children in the course of their year is she develops a relationship with them and with their families that lasts their whole life. I think that Maura Millie teaches kids, even at the age of three and four, to be independent, to take responsibility, and to care about each other. And I would say that Maura Millie has really defined our preschool experience at Berman. She's really kind and like not like strict. And like if you, say, if you make a mistake, she's like, it's okay. Like, everyone makes mistakes. She wants people, even if they come to her class with a frown on their face, she wants them to leave with a smile. Working with Leia has shown me how to bring the kids to the point where they come up with their answer through the, the, the process of thinking. The kids learn empathy take care of each other, be aware of each other's feelings. Moralea deserves to be honored because she's an amazing teacher, an amazing teacher, yeah. The kids really learn to believe in themselves, I think because of the way she believes in them. She's brilliant and loving and amazing at being a kindergarten teacher. Mrs. Oppenheim's enthusiasm and energy is completely contagious. So her whole classroom environment is filled with excitement and love of learning about the subject matter, be it math or science, but also about learning in general. She takes time out of her day to make sure that she is interacting with the kids and um, I would say her mission in teaching is to make sure each and every kid leaves her classroom uh, feeling successful. I've always, I guess, been obsessed with Miss Offenheim. I don't know, I love the way she teaches. She's so fun. She'll get very excited about teaching us in a different way or whatever we're learning. She'll be like, today we're learning this, and she gets super excited. My sister makes an effort to build a relationship in and out of the classroom, which I think helps us learn a lot, but also um, enjoy the class more and enjoy the learning. She's kind, caring about her students. She doesn't just want them to learn the Hebrew language, she wants to make sure that she's passing on values of Berman, uh, that she's teaching people about the culture of Israel and what's going on to make sure that they I feel a connection to Israel and not just the Hebrew language. I think that, that the love for Israel is very much evident in everything she does uh, uh, here at school and kids know it and appreciate it, I think. Uh, she's good-hearted, she's kind, she's devoted to her work, she, she loves the community of uh, our school and it's amazing. It's amazing to feel this way after 25 years. Michael has been my bus driver since around kindergarten and ever since I first met him, he's always cared about me and everybody on his bus individually. Not only am I appreciative for him, but so are my parents. Michael, I refer to him as the gentle giant. He's, he never gets upset, he's always pleasant with people. He knows an awful lot about basketball and one of the reasons I incorporated him into our coaching team here at the Academy. 
it's an experience every day. Michael is kind hearted, um, prompt, love to work with the kids. It's a, it's a pleasure working with Michael. I can't really put it all into words because Michael is just Michael. <laughs> it's just, but that's my friend.